the next evolution of Ryobi batteries. All right, just announced we have the Lithium High Performance Edge or the Lithium Edge High Performance, however you want to say it. It's the next evolution of battery technology utilizing tabless lithium battery cells coming summer 2024. It boasts or claims more power, more runtime, runs cooler, lives longer. See it to believe it. There you go. Be the first to know. So, this is uh, utilizing a different type of, uh, not like the pouch cells like you see on like uh, the new Milwaukee battery or some of the Flex batteries, but this utilizes um, a different type of way of connecting each lithium ion cell inside the battery itself. Traditionally, uh <clears throat> they don't use a there's a button top and there's a flat top uh battery cell most of your triple a double a cd batteries have like what they call like a the button at the top i mean it has like this you know you can clearly see the positive versus the negative side um and these battery cells for like these power tool batteries they use flat top batteries so there's no pronounced button or or divot or anything on either side of the battery and they use uh <clears throat> they use uh, some sort of conductive metal some uh, and then they weld they use like a little spot weld on each side of the battery to connect everything well in tablets that's not the case um <clears throat> it allows for these batteries to uh it lowers the resistance for the current transfer and when you lower the resistance, you lower you you uh, the, you lower the heat that that's produced by the by the using the battery. So overall, this is going to be your battery is going to run cooler. Uh, they're claiming a little bit longer runtime, and because of that lower resistance, um, there's less of a bottleneck. Now, don't think that this is Ryobi's the first to the show on this, um, Bosch back in august of 2023 announced the same technology they were utilizing in their power core 18 volt batteries and um we just didn't get a lot of fanfare it wasn't really i didn't see anybody talking about it and i hadn't really hear anything about it and um but anyway this is pretty uh you know battery technology is always changing what we thought wasn't possible two or three years ago is possible you know, just really interesting to see where it kind of goes from here. But anyway, it looks like they're coming out with a four amp hour battery. I don't know if they're going to use a smaller battery or not. Maybe, like you know, if it's going to be a two amp hour battery or not. But seems to be that the four amp hour battery is like what the five amp hour Milwaukee battery is to me. Kind of like the best overall you can use it on a drill, you can use it on a saw, you can use it on a impact, uh, you can use it on almost anything, a light, the OPE equipment. But anyway, just to me, in my opinion, I just think the Milwaukee 5 amp hour battery is the <clears throat> best overall battery for most everything. Uh, is it is it the best for the string trim or no? But you know, if I'm going to, if I had to, I'd take a five with me because I know I can use that on that and I can use it on a, a drill and I can use it on anything else. And it's not going to be too cumbersome. But anyway, it's neither here nor there. Uh, anyway, I'll put the link to this page below if you want to check it out. Peace.